O.J. Simpson's dramatic end run through Orange County began when a sheriff's deputy spotted him on Interstate 5. The officer, along with three other Orange County sheriff's deputies, made up the first line of patrol cars trailing Simpson on his way to Brentwood. They spoke for the first time Monday, reflecting on their part in the amazing chase that ended with Simpson's arrest. OCN's Nick Barris has details. Four Orange County Sheriff's deputies led the way, chasing the white Ford Bronco carrying O.J. Simpson. The leader issued these orders to those behind him. Just minutes earlier, during a short stop on the I-5 at Grand in Santa Ana, Sergeant Jim Sewell had asked the driver, Al Cowling, to turn off the engine. Window was down. He looked back at me and indicated that he wasn't going to do that. So the chase continued, eventually ending, of course, in Brentwood. By then, a convoy of patrol cars tailed the Bronco, but Orange County Sheriff's Deputy Larry Poole and Sergeant Sewell remained at the front. In fact, Deputy Poole was the very first person to spot Simpson, this while making his way back to headquarters in Santa Ana. I wasn't able to see O.J. Simpson from the back. I was able to uh, see a, what I perceived to be a rather athletically built male subject driving the vehicle. Uh, at that time, when I got up behind the car, I confirmed the plate, called the plate in, and it came back, uh, in fact, being the vehicle that we were looking for. Both men agreed that the chase went smoothly, especially considering that thousands of people lined the roadway. It made it very difficult. I don't think there's been anything like it uh, probably in the, the history of America when it comes to a pursuit. And both men agreed they've never encountered a more famous suspect, something they thought about at times during the chase. Well, I think that uh, O.J. Simpson is uh, one of the greatest running backs in the history of the, uh, the game. And uh, he was in college and in the pros when I was playing in high school. And I always uh, was amazed at his skill in uh, running the football. I think that uh, if, in fact, uh, he's convicted of, of the charges, then it's, it's a tragedy. In Santa Ana, Nick Barris, Orange County News Channel. Orange County Sheriff's deputies say they did not hear the reports from other motorists that Simpson had been seen on Interstate 5. Deputy Larry Poole says he was just in the right place at the right time when he spotted the Ford Bronco.